So like, my dad's the greatest dude in, just the greatest dude in the world. And, and in almost every way, I want to be like him. Uh, but when Duke was born, you know, part of the spiritual mentor hero thing was realizing like, I want to be like him, but I don't want his life. I don't want to live uh, the kind of life that he lived and not because it's like bad or good or anything, but it's just not me. You know, it's not, it, it wouldn't be my life. And coming to terms with like, oh, he was just a dude too. That was like, he was just figuring shit out, you know? And then having that like, uh, that concept of a hero die, not because he did anything, but just realizing like, oh man, like I can't even really look to my dad to see how like I want to navigate life, you know? Morally and uh, character-wise, yes. But as, as far as like the day-to-day, the -day, so allowing that to die was like hard, you know? It's, it's really hard. Like, having uh, the concept of heroes like that die. Because he came from really kind of shitty upbringing and traumatic uh, childhood and created something beautiful. So like he did what I want to do in a way, because he's like, none of this, I, I don't want any of this, I'm gonna create something of my own. But that means not following his blueprint, you know? And he gave me the freedom to do that. He gave me the, the landing space to do that, but then to realize that that blueprint's gone. I don't know, it's a death, it's a death. And death is, even the good ones are like, Sad. There's always mourning that goes on.